Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about Bose Einstein condensation. I am Nikhil Rai Prolu from International Institute of Information Technology, Hyderabad. Bose Einstein condensation. Bose Einstein condensate is a state of matter in which separate atoms or subatomic particles cool to near absolute zero, curl is into a single quantum mechanical entity. This form of matter was predicted in 1924 by Albert Einstein on the basis of the quantum formulations of the Indian physicist Satyendranath Bose. At Bose-Einstein condensate, or in short, BEC, a large fraction of bo uh, bosons occupy the lowest quantum state at which point microscopic quantum phenomena like wave function interference become ap apparent. A Bose-Einstein condensate is formed by cooling a gas of extremely low density, about 100,000 the density of normal air, to ultra-low temperatures of nanokelvin. Let's look at the practical experimentation of Bose-Einstein condensate. The first atomic Bose-Einstein condensate was made by Eric Cornell and Carl Wieman cooled a gas of rubidium atoms to 1.7 into 10 power minus 7 Kelvin and they received no rise in 2001. The procedure followed by, um, by Eric Cornell and Carl Wieman for this experimentation of Bose-Einstein uh, condensation is as follows. First atoms are, are isolated from sodium molecule. Then six concurrent lasers, uh, laser beams are applied onto the atoms and after absorption of photons, the atoms emit energy back as photons flowing down them. This decreases the temperature but to just a millikelvin. We still need it to be dropped to nanokelvins. To drop the temperature to nanokelvin, we use evaporation type uh, type methodology, where a magnetic field is applied around the atom, which could be imagined like a mug-like structure, and the strength of the magnetic field is decreased slowly to a lower level, and atoms which have higher energies tend to jump out of the magnetic field. And finally, this reduces the temperature to nanokelvin, creating Bose-Einstein condensate with the, with the atoms which have the lower energy and stayed inside the mag magnetic field. As per the observation of by uh, Bose, photons belong to one of the two classes of elementary or sub-microscopic particles defined by whether their quantum spin is a non-negative integer that is 0, 1, 2, and so on, or an odd half integer, that is 1 by 2, 3 by 2, and so on. The former type called uh, bosons include photons, which spin is 1. The later type called fermions include electrons, whose spin is half. The two classes behave differently. According to Pauli's exclusion principle, fermions tend to avoid each other, for which reasons each electron in a group occupies a separate quantum state. In contrast, an unlimited number of bosons can have the same energy state and share a single quantum state. Let's look at the Einstein's extension to Bose's work. Einstein extended Bose's work to show that at extremely low temperature, bosonic atoms with even spins would coalesce into a single shade quantum state at the lowest available energy. The requisite me methods to produce temperatures lower um, enough to test Einstein's prediction did not become attainable. But after the experimentation technique, which ha has got Nobel Prize in 2001, was established in, uh, using radiation procedure of lasers and magnetic confinement in order to hold the atoms without a material container, succeeded in merging 2,000 individual atoms into a superatom, a condensate large enough to observe with a microscope that displayed distinct quantum properties. Now, look, now let's look at mathematical explanation of the Bose-Einstein condensate. According to Heisenberg and certainty principle, as the value for momentum becomes more certain, the position of the atoms become more uncertain. The wave packet that describes the individual atoms become delocalized. So, as delta x into delta p is greater than or equal to h by 2 here, as the atom cools down, their kinetic energy and hence momentum reduce. Also, by de Broglie's equation, we know that lambda is equal to h by p, 
P is equal to mv and solving upon these two equations we get lambda is equal to h by mv and if we check here as v decreases lambda increases so at very low temperatures temperatures v decreases and wavelength increases exceeding the atomic distance between the atoms thereby making the atoms indistinguishable on the application side of BEC or Bose-Einstein condensate Bose-Einstein condensate can slow down light in 1998 Le Leneho of Harvard University and her colleagues slowed down light traveling through a BEC through its speed in uh, a from its speed in vacuum of 3 into 10 to 8 meters per second to mere 17 meter per second. This, these manipulations hold promise for new types of light-based telecommunications, optical storage of data, and quantum computing. Other future applications could be development of most sensitive detectors um, using BEC, development of optical lattices, which could be easily modifiable by varying the interplanar spacing. And this is, th thanks a lot.